So there's the plug. That was for the dryer and the wall. That plug goes to this dryer buddy. This plug's for the dryer. This one goes to the Tesla. Tesla's charging right now. And turn on the dryer. The Tesla will stop charging. Turn the dryer off. And within about 10 seconds, usually the Tesla starts charging again. There it goes. It'll go all the way to 24 amps. That's what it's set to for the NEMA 1030 plug. This extension cord runs behind the washer, behind all the stuff. To the juice box. Juice box has a NEMA 1030 to 1050 adapter. 1050 set to 24 amps through the uh, the app and on the car as well. There's the plug going into the car. Orange means it's charging. Blink and blue means it's connecting back to Wi-Fi since it just rebooted since I ran the dryer a few seconds ago. Green means good power. And inside the car, getting 239 volts, 24 amps, 20 miles an hour. This voltage reads really, really close. And the amperage. To the meter, that's on the dryer buddy. Getting really close here. 240.7 volts, 24.2 amps, uh, so there's about 0.2 amps of losses to heat through the juice box. And almost a kilowatt's been delivered already. Pretty cool. This is the Dryer Buddy 1 Plus uh, with the automatic relay that pops on and off between the dryer and the EVSE plug with two NEMA 1030 outlets.